This is pre-calc. We are working on this practice assessment for topic seven. We're looking at this table and this seems to be adding one each time, but there's no, I don't see a real great pattern going that way if I just try and add. So let me try and do a little multiplication. Uh, times two gives me four. Let's see, 384 divided by 24, 16. So that would be times 16. Let me try this one. Four gets up to eight. So times two. So 61, 44 divided by 384. That's also times 16. Yeah, I think this is a multiply, multiply one. Let me check it. Uh, three to six is times two. Uh, 121.5 times 16 is, uh, yeah, is 1944. This is a multiply, multiply. So this is a power relationship. So I know the, the model for power is y equals a times um, x to the some power. So let me plug in some values and see what I can do. Um, I'll just grab this second point here. When y is uh, 121.5, x is 3. I don't like that one. I'm going to grab this one, 384. When y is 384, x is 4. And when y is uh, 24, x is 2. So let's see. Uh, I know that 384 divided by, I'm going to divide here. 384 divided by 24 is 16. A divided by A is 1. And then I have this 4 to the b divided by 2 to the b. That's the same as 4 halves to the b, which is 2 to the, to the b. So 2 to what power would give me 16? I either know it or I can run it through, you know, a log base 2 of 16. But either way, I think it's 4. 2, 4, 8, 16. Yep, b is 4. So let me plug that back in and get uh, my a value. I'll plug it into this one. Uh, 24 equals a times 2 to the 4th power. So let's see, 2 to the 4th power, I just did that, is 16. Uh, 24 is 16 times a, so then I can go 24 divided by 16 to get my, uh, get my a value. And that's 1.5. Great, so my model should be y equals uh, 1.5 times x to the fourth. Let me check it on my calculator and see if uh, see if that I can match up the table with that. So uh, 1.5 times uh, x to the fourth power, x to the fourth. Peek at my table, and I've got some values like two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, sure looks like a match to me. So there we go.